Hello, I'm engineer Haruna Musa, a PhD student of mechanical engineering, faculty of engineering, University of Meduguri, northeastern Nigeria. I'm developing a thermal insulator from a agricultural product, sodium apple fiber, calatropis procera. Due to increase in population and industrialization in 21st century, coupled with prediction of global warming and climate change, has increased the need for thermal insulation material. Currently, the commonly used thermal insulation material is synthetic in nature which is associated with numerous problems. They are of high cost. They are non-biodegradable, non-renewable, and it requires a significant amount of energy and use of fossil fuel in their manufacture. They, there is emission of toxic and volatile compound in their decomposition. They are associated with health and environmental problem. Our solution is made from natural insulation material of Calatropis porosera fruit fiber that is biodegradable renewable, affordable, and inexpensive, safer, and healthier. It is environmental friendly. It has low thermal conductivity, non-toxic, non-volatile. At the same time, it exhibits little or no decomposition after a long period of time. Our material can be used in stock, incinerator, refrigeration, kiln, oven, and other type of thermal devices and system. Equally, it can be used in building walls. Performance evaluation was being conducted using different ty different types of binding materials and it has been compared with different type of synthetic insulation material from the test result it was found that our material is the best alternative of synthetic material. I am very much grateful to the IFIA, which is organized by the collaboration of Israel Embassy, Office of the Vice President, Federal Republic of Nigeria, and SkillsG Nigeria Limited. It had assisted me in so many ways by providing me with mentors that make my idea to be reality. It has assisted me with a space where I have been able to develop my prototype. I make use of a lot of equipment, instrument, and consumable material that we use in developing this thermal insulating material, which I hope it will be promising and will assist in so many ways. Thank you. In order to validate the performance of our material, a 
performance evaluation experiment has been conducted in order to compare the performance, the thermal conductivity of the synthetic thermal insulation material and our material. This is a fiber from agricultural products of sodium apple in which we put it in a, this case and this is also a synthetic thermal insulation material. We conducted the experiment and it shows that our material perform better than the synthetic one. This one is, has a low thermal conductivity. And now we are comparing the uh, performance of different binding agents. This one we use top bone as a binding agent to make it solid and this one we use a cassava starch to make it solid thermal conductivity material. This is what we call the proof that we can put into, a, into this container to measure the temperature of the water inside. And this is also a prop. As you can see now, there is the graph shows that both of them are having almost the same uh, thermal conductivity. That means our material, it shows that it has a good, it has a low thermal conductivity in the sense that our own is affordable, is sustainable, biodegradable, renewable, and it is of cheap material, of cheap cost. Therefore, we can use this type of natural insulator as a best alternative to synthetic material.